Fancy footwork, super strength, endless endurance. That is a lot of what it takes to achieve maximum success in athletics. Dominic Flora and his crew at Competitive Sports Performance in Fruitland are committed to helping athletes get there. Now this is a fitness facility which offers folks the opportunity to truly train like the pros. And for 20 years, it's helped athletes all over the Eastern Shore set and achieve big time goals. Here's Del Marvel Life's Katie Zarelli. Hard work for high level competition. This fitness facility in Fruitland offers a specific scientific type of training. Sports performance is training athletes the way they perform on the field. Dominic Flora is the owner and president here at Competitive Sports Performance. All his life, he's been enthusiastic about athletic advancement. Just love seeing athletes, my, myself included, how could I get better, how could I gain the edge on the competition. And so for more than 20 years, he's offered that opportunity to athletes all over the Eastern Shore. When youth athletes, middle and high school athletes, and those at the collegiate level step onto this turf, they train like the pros. Basically every, every single sport. What makes us unique as well is, you know, we go into movement specific, position specific training as well. So once our kids have the, you know, four mechanics, they're in, we get them better in shape and then we get into more, you know, movement specific training. They'll work with each and every athlete to set and smash their aspirations. Yeah, we get a baseline with all our athletes, uh, both in the, in the weight room and then as well, you know, speed. So we'll do short, short, what we call it fly tens, where it's like a 10 yard laser time, 20 yards, 40 yards, and then we do our distance training as well, like how conditioned are they, you know, a mile run, a half mile run. And then we kind of talk to each athlete, get their goals, uh, what they're trying to accomplish, and then we kind of put the program together for the kids. This is available to all athletes even the underprivileged at-risk youth. Dominic started the nonprofit Off-Street Competitive Sports Performance 10 years ago for that reason. We provide the same training and they're mixed in with our regular, you know, customers, so you don't know that, you know, it may or may not be an underprivileged, you know, student, but we also provide academic tutoring for them, a mentor, um, and then obviously the training, and then we do college readiness. Working like the pros requires recovering like them, too. Dominic recently partnered with Travis Light of Strive Sports Medicine Physical Therapy to make this spot a one-stop shop. I, I kind of got interested in physical therapy when my mom went through a, a knee surgery, and um, I talked to her physical therapist as she was going through um, her rehab process and kind of got interested in it, helping other people and, and with the athlete side of things, helping them get back on the field and get back to doing what they love. And so his approach is individualized. Whether they just had a, a surgery and we need to communicate with the, the physician and the surgeon and figure out um, you know, where we're at, where we need to get to, or if it's just a, a, a smaller injury that they need to work through for a short period of time or need some guidance in working through. Travis uses highly effective equipment and tried and true techniques to help these athletes get back out there better than before. Look at a little bit of both sides of things to, to help them work through that process and, and get them back on the field and, you know, at a high level and, and hopefully eventually higher level than, than even before injury to get them back to reduce the risk of, of re-injury or additional injury as they go back. Dominic encourages anyone and everyone with a goal to give this place a go. The, the main thing that we get is I'm scared of CSP because I heard it's very hard, you know, <laughs> so that, that you, you know, we'll get that sometimes and that's when we say, you know, hey, just come in and try it. And our coaching staff is phenomenal. They've been with me for years. Most of my staff is athletes that I trained in high school, college, and you know, they may have went local SU or they went away, but now they come back. Um, so they know our system, they've been through our system, and now they, they work here, you know, with us as well. Keep your feet moving. Four. I feel like I'm, okay, here we go. Move my feet, go I gotta hip. tend to get beat. Five, all right, this one, we will come up, we got high knees. Here we go, here we go. 40 high knees. Dry, 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 dry. There you go, hold that position, keep going. 
Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Five, four, <laughs> three, two, one. Walk it back. Yeah. Good job. That training <laughs> tested me, but the recovery was just right. And Dominic says folks come from as far away as from across the bridge, the Bay Bridge, Wilmington, and near the Bay Bridge Tunnel to train here. To read testimonials from the athletes themselves, visit their website. You can find that link on delmarvalife.com. From across the bridge to Delmarva, that says a lot. That does say a lot.